Are you a ladder climber or a ladder builder? Here is what the difference is. As leaders, we have to make the shift from climbing the ladder ourselves and advancing our leadership and advancing in our career and advancing our business to building ladders for our leaders and upcoming leaders to climb. One of the great, you know, successes of a leader is to develop other leaders. And how can you develop other leaders? Well, is to offering opportunities, creating opportunities for those leaders, opening doors for them, uh, connecting them with people that could help them advance their, their career. So as a leader, if we really want to leave a legacy and build a successful company, we have to start shifting from climbing the ladder ourselves to building ladders for others to climb. But here is the catch. You can't build ladders for others to, ca- to, to climb on if you haven't been successful yourself. So you first have to climb your own ladder to become influential, to become successful, to be able to have influence. So then you can pass on that influence to your people as well. But as a leader, that's one of the biggest shifts we have to make from developing ourselves to developing the team, from developing followers to developing leaders, and from climbing ourselves to helping other people climb. And one of the best ways to expose your people to leadership Uh, potential and to leadership um, insights is to bring them with you on the journey. So if you're planning to attend the Live to Lead conference in Gothenburg, then bring some of your people with you. That is the fastest way for you to pass on that information. Invite them to the leadership table. And as you do that, you're going to kind of shortcut the, the process. Instead of you learning something, then going you know, you're in your organization, in your office, and trying to pass it on to your people, bring them to the source. You know, take them with you on the journey. When you attend conferences, take some of your key leaders with you. When you go visit clients, take some of your key leaders with you. When you um, invest in yourself, invest also in, in, in some of your key leaders, because that's how you multiply leaders in your organization.